Jetzt mal. Yeah. <gasps> okay, let's just put it here for now, okay? Hi everyone, welcome to a new video. On today's vlog, Leah and I will be doing a gluten-free uh, raisin oatmeal cookies. So this will be our first baking video and I hope... Oh, <laughs> We'll be back in some five minutes. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to a new video. So on today's video, Leia, Miss Leia and I will be doing our first baking video. Am I right, Leia? Um, so <laughs> she's pretty busy right now, but we had a little bit of a hiccup in the beginning of this video and now we're fully dry. Everything is fully operational. So before I get started, I'll just give you guys a quick intro to the ingredients and I'll make sure to pop it up, maybe put in the description with the actual uh, measurement details. And this time we're making a gluten-free uh, raisin oatmeal cookies. So for our ingredients, we have a butter, we have a butter, uh, we have a peanut butter, and we have some brown sugar, we have two eggs, which Leia has already cracked one already, and we have a vanilla extract, and we also have a cinnamon powder, and we have some oats, and lastly, we have some raisins. All right, so let's get started, shall we, Leia? So the very first step is to preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit, which is around 170 degrees Celsius, which we have done already. All right, now the second step is in a large bowl, cream together the softened butter, peanut butter, and sugars. Okay, so we gotta put in the butter. Leia, you wanna help mommy? Yay! Yeah, you wanna help mommy mix Yay. the ingredients? Yay! Oh, <laughs> Leia, you want to help me put in the sugar? Yeah? Oh, the sugar is stuck <laughs> because it's a brown sugar. It got kind of formulated into that. Yay! All right, and lastly, we'll just have to put in some peanut butter. Bruh. Oh, this is a gluten-free recipe, so it means it doesn't have flour. So I think because it's gluten-free, it's using a whole lot of peanut butter. Uh, one cup and a third of peanut butter, just to almost... Um, so that everything can stick together, right? Okay, so this is a half cup going in. Whee! Okay. Yay! Yay! Next. Maybe this will be the one third, right, Leia? Okay, maybe you can put that in. Yay! Okay, there you go. Whoa! So we don't have an electrical whisk, whisk, so what we're gonna do is just we're gonna microwave the whole thing for 30 seconds. Uh, well, it's, it's typically not recommended to microwave the ingredients, especially when you're baking, but <laughs> this is a big session with Leia. Nothing is really going according to plan, right? Oh, this feels so yummy. Leia was a bit crazy before this video. And then as soon as the video started, she's kind of quiet, which I'm very mm. <laughs> surprised. Mm. <laughs> Do you like it, Leia? Mm, yummy. All right, so this is the wet, wet ingredients. It's like a very um, liquidy peanut butter at this point. Okay, now we're gonna add the eggs in here. Leah, do you want to see me crack the eggs? Woohoo! Yay! Well, Leah's most likely gonna eat this thing, so she's pretty much dipping her hands into everything and I assume that's okay with you, right Leia? Okay, so let's add the eggs in here. Uh, we're gonna have some tea two teaspoons of vanilla. Okay, 
I'm just going to add pretty much everything, guys. Wow! <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo! So this is the oats. But according to the recipe, it's better to be quick oats, which means it's a little bit more gr grinded. So what I'm going to do is, mommy's going to try and... Oh, no! No! <laughs> I'm just going to grind the oatmeal real quick. Just with this blender. Ah! Oh, I could have done this the whole time. Bruh. Much easier. Yahoo! So this is my portable blender. Oh, yay! Okay. in here, Leia. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Mm, it's grinding. Um, I also don't want it like all in a very dust format. Like I also want like huge chunks in there. So I'm just gonna leave the last bit as its own. And then yeah, let's mix everything now, Leia. Now, mix, 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 Leia. I'm gonna put in the raisins. Mix. Do you know Nick? Apparently, the butter is supposed to melt in the oven. Right? <laughs> Leia. Leia is acting as if she's doing nothing. <laughs> like if everything she's doing is like on point. Yeah. Okay. So I love baking. I used to bake a lot when I was a in high school and also when I was a freshman. But then as soon as kind of uni life hit my life as soon as i got hit by the reality of uni life and the crazy library study sessions and the final exams and just um, life in general i stopped baking i didn't have time to bake anymore and you know for a very busy uni student i think baking is almost like a privilege of an extra hobby time so yeah i'm very happy to be baking again but this time with the help of my little assistant called Miss Leia, right? Okay. All right, so I think we're almost done, guys. So this is the final um, look of the batch. And because it's gluten-free, um, I'm surprised it's actually very much sticky, even though we didn't use any flour. Um, I think the peanut butter actually really, really holds it well together. Okay, now step number four is shape into golf-sized balls um, and place two inches apart on an ungreased baking sheet. So we don't have a baking sheet, instead we used tin foil and I wasn't sure if I was supposed to grease it but I did put a little bit of a butter on my sheet so let's move to the fourth part. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Interestingly, so I just tasted the whole batch. Mm. It's so good. Like just the batch on its own. Um, our assistant is on uh, is taking a break. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Leia, you can rest. You can rest. Mm -hmm. And so our assistant is on a little mini break. I, I guess she's very tired from all the work that she's been doing. You know, she's been a great assistant, right, Leia? Oh, yeah, she's closing her eyes. Uh, she wants to go to maybe sleepy time soon. So what we're going to do now is we're going to clean this up a little bit. We're going to have our um, golf-sized... We're going to shape our batch into some golf-sized balls. And then I'll meet you guys right back when it's time to put it into the oven. Oh, high five! Bah! Bah!
you guys. The whole kitchen smells like peanut butter. <laughs> Alright guys, so the first batch came out and um, our expectation was that it's gonna become like a flat like a cookie, but it didn't. Um, not sure why or where it went wrong or it's supposed to be like this. Not sure because this is my first time making a gluten-free cookie. Mm. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna taste it again. Mm. High five! Big hands! Mm. I like it! I think if we give it a, a bit more time for it to cool down, it's gonna like really come together and it's gonna be like this really little bit of a hard, healthy cookie, right? Or a snack ball or snack. So, Leia, do you like it? So if Leia doesn't like something, usually she would just, if, if, as soon as it's in her mouth and she doesn't like it, she would spit it out. But she's not spitting it out, so that's a te uh, taste test. Whoa! Taste test. Um, a successful one from Leia, right? Alright guys, so this is it for today's video. Um, I'm hoping to do maybe like a yearly baking video with Leia or a cooking one and yeah we'll see how next year's or the next baking cooking video will go right thank you for being my assistant Leia thank you for being my assistant and starring in my vlog now sleepy time hi hi Leia why don't you share some of the words you can say now no. Leia, bye bye. Leia, say bye bye. 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 Bye